graduation day and we decided to walk around and have some fun with our latest graduates in town. Let's get interactive. My name is Honey. This is Play Blast. Congratulations to you. Thank you very much, Play Plus. Uh, yes, Play Plus Multimedia, actually. I really love your work, and I've been working with them since level 100. I think they are one of the best campus photographers I've seen. Campus Media, actually. I recommend them to the world. In fact, we hear from them. In fact, I, I knew what they can do here. Yeah. Share with us your experiences on campus for, you know, four years, junior four years. Mm, actually, I, I could say that it's even more than four years. COVID has actually extended our stay on campus. So, it was very good at the point. It was very bad at the point. It was very joyful at the point. You feel like giving up, but then uh, all the same, we are able to make things work for ourselves. Okay, because some of us, we know where we are coming from. It's not our best, so we needed to put in much effort. So uh, even in the difficult times, we were able to stand on our feet to say yes, we can do it, and that's how we've been able to survive campus. Patience, patience. Today is graduation day. How do you feel? Oh, it's so nice. Coming here is not easy. Four years being in school is not easy. It's not really easy. I came in for my friends. Congratulations to them. It's not easy. Thank you. So you are not part. You came in for your friends. But you are not part. I just came in for my friends. I'm just a friend. Do you have a memorable day you would like to, you know, <laughs> tell us? Mm -hmm. Oh, the memorable day that I would like to share is the day that I, I the first time that I came here. Yeah, that very day, like I was very stranded, but I was new on campus and like I don't know what to do when I pass here and I don't have friends, I don't know anyone, so it's like I'm all alone that very day. Yeah. Sammy, congratulations. Thank you. How do you feel currently? Um, I'm very happy that I've graduated. I've spent four years in school, it's not easy. It's just by the grace of God, so I'm very happy today. So share with us some of your experiences during your four years on campus. Well, uh, it's not easy anyway, but it's, it's, you can attain that. Um, lectures, we had PZs, a whole lot of things. But then by the grace of God, we are able to make you. So I'm just saying that anybody at all who has the passion to go to tertiary education can make it. My name is Michael Bansa. So you actually came here for your younger brother? My younger brother. So how do you feel for him right now? Oh. Seems is very nice and very, very, very good. Yeah. What do you say to him? Oh, what I can say to him, uh, God has done everything. So we give thanks to God for his protection and everything. You were a leader. So how were you able to combine, you know, this leadership mantle with academic work? Oh, okay, so I would personally say that when you're born a leader, you're actually a leader. Because some of us, we've actually started this leadership team since level 100, right? When we got on campus, we figure out where we fit best and we joined. I actually started with um, UC's Parliamentary Council and then I started everything there, level 100. I joined them, I performed very well, I contributed so much and then they gave me the Deputy Minority Speaker for UCC House of Parliament, that's level 100. And level 200 actually, uh, I went to my department to contest for a position as well. I'm always leading and I always try to serve people. So I went there and my effort there has also worked well for me and I had the organizer for School of Economics and I think I've served them best. Memories are best there as well. And then level 300, I went back to my hall of affiliation. That is Valco Hall, the best on campus actually in terms of everything. Economic, in terms of everything, entertainment, everything, education. And there too, got me so good. I've been able to force my way through and um, the people supported me and I won the position as the Valco SRC rep too, that's for level 300 actually. So my stay on campus, I've always been working as an executive and all this while too, I've never given my book up. I've still been studying and I knew I've been able to do something best. I've made my mom proud, I've made UCC proud as well. Because when they are calling at least, they will call some of us as well. Yeah. I think my memorable day it was my first week on campus. I had to write a quiz in economics. And uh, actually, I didn't write anything better, so <laughs> I had one over 20. <laughs> and I, I called my mom that I, I didn't think this school is best for me, so I have to give up and find some business. And you know, I'm actually a businessman as well. Mommy has trained me to be a business boy, so I called him. I should have had a pass through the business side and see if I could become more than her. She was like, no, she couldn't make it to school, so I have to make it. So whether I like or not, I have to stay and make it. And even though my start was very poor. That's one of our 20, my first case. I think 
Um, the whole school of economics, my name is there. People know me for the best thing I've done for the school and for my contribution as well. At least I've, I've, I think I've made my mom proud. She's so happy when she came around today. She was so happy. She was like, you did it. I knew you can. And at least I've done something so proud for my mom. I think today is, is one of the moments that I will never forget in my life.